to change lanes. Welcome again to another educational video on driving and traffic. This video is going to be a tutorial on how to properly change lanes, something that every beginner driver should safely know how to do. Many people feel very insecure regarding changing lanes. Many want to know how to do this correctly, want to change lanes and all about the blind spot that could be intimidating for many. In this video, I will discuss techniques on how to achieve this as well as many mistakes that beginner drivers make when changing lanes. For starters, it's imperative that when changing lanes, you do the following. Quickly put your turning signal flashing light towards the direction you desire to go before you start changing lanes or turning. It's also very important that you check your mirrors also before changing lanes or turning, just to verify that it's clear and that you can proceed safely. And of course, it's important that you check your blind spot to avoid surprises which could be unseen vehicles near you. Always remember that when turning or changing lanes, you have to make all these verifications. You need to be aware that when you will be checking for your blind spot, you need to do so in a matter of seconds and quickly while safely driving. You need to look at the mirror and over your shoulder to make sure and confirm that there is no vehicle near you. It takes practice. Now many people ask, where is the blind spot? Blind spot is the angle in which another vehicle is near the back of your car, near the bumper, on the other lane where you want to change to, and through the lateral mirrors you don't fully get to see the vehicle. This is why I tell you that you need to check not only through the mirror, but also looking over your shoulder. Now a common mistake that many beginner drivers do is that they tend to look over the shoulder and stay looking for a long period of time, longer than they should to see if they can detect other vehicles and this is a mistake indeed because if you spend too much time focusing and staring at the back you may lose control of your vehicle. Another common mistake made by beginners is that when changing lanes many press down the brakes and the car loses velocity. Now because of doing this all the other vehicles on the road that are going faster than you are going to want to pass you now and therefore not give you the opportunity for you to safely change lanes. This is why you should maintain the same speed of other vehicles. Make sure to evaluate their speeds. And if you see that another vehicle is going too fast, wait for him or her to pass and then change lanes. Okay, so how do I know when another vehicle is close enough or far? This is another important question. If you look at your lateral mirror and see the full entire vehicle as I'm showing you here, then this means the vehicle is far enough and you may change lanes safely. Remember to maintain the same speed or accelerate just a little bit. When you're going to change lanes, you must also do so diagonally and laterally. You don't want to make a sudden turn because you can easily lose the control of your vehicle. This is very important guys, you gotta move very slowly and cautiously, obviously. Now, if the vehicle is too close, then you will see half the vehicle just like I'm demonstrating on this video. This means that the vehicle is in the blind spot, wants to pass and you shall not change lanes at the moment. So what happens if the other vehicle doesn't pass you and remains in the position and the same speed? which does not allow you to change lanes either. Well, it's actually quite simple. In this case, you're going to turn off your flashing signal light and reduce your speed just a little so that he or she thinks that you no longer want to change lanes and pass you. Don't confuse what I said earlier regarding not reducing your speed when changing lanes. In this case, I'm referring to reducing your speed in order for other vehicles to pass you. Then you shall do all verifications that was previously mentioned and change lanes. Last but not least, a very important thing is always to put your flashing turning signal lights on. 
Obviously, this is very crucial. You must immediately signal your turn ahead of time so that other vehicles know that you plan on turning to the desired lane. You can't just turn or change lanes without your signal lights. I highly recommend before heading out into traffic to safely practice to confidently control your vehicle. This is very important. There's many beginner drivers that without practice go out into traffic and are very insecure when changing lanes, which can be very unsafe for you and other drivers. All right, we have gone over a few aspects that are extremely important when it comes to driving. Now, I really again recommend to you guys to make sure you practice in order to gain confidence and the necessary ability to drive safely. Just so you know, when going to take the driver's practical examination, you will be asked to change lanes. So it is something that you should definitely have mastered by then. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to subscribe to this channel for more driving tutorials like these. Also, I have the driving practice exam questions with answers that you can study in order to be well prepared for your theoretical and practical examination. And you can find these in my channel or below in the description. Make sure to leave a thumbs up if you find this helpful and also to subscribe once again if you haven't and leave your comment below because I would truly appreciate it. Thank you again and have a wonderful day.